Hey everyone, GoBots here today with a brand new episode for MLB The Show 19, Road to the Show, with Nate Stark as we continue on here with our Summer of Horror here on the channel. As we're continuing with Road to the Show today, you'll also see The Evil Within 2 as well uh, later on in the day at 11 a.m. Central Standard Time. I hope you're having a great day though, and I thank you again for making this Road to the Show episode a part of your day. As we get an off day, we lose, uh, but we're coming in here today struggling a little bit um the numbers aren't as high as we'd like them to be as we have yet not played the giants yet this season we're 19 and 11 now on the year got a game lead against the pirates and we got to go up against Derek rodriguez who's four and two of the three five seven era he's a righty on the mound he struggles with walks you see that it's a 27 strikeout 21 walk ratio there um but again y'all i just appreciate you being here today y'all uh, your continual support here on the channel is just I'm forever thankful for that because it's just it's, it's awesome. It's awesome having this growing community here on the channel. Um, but here it's a little overcasty day as we uh, get ready to get things done today against this team. As we now jump out to a 2 0 lead, Baez at second after the double. As we come up to the plate here in this first inning with a 2 0 lead, only one out with a 268 batting average for Nate Stark currently on the season. And we'll watch the change up outside and miss away. 1-0 count for start. But uh, just a little bit we'll talk about um, summer plans, continuing on with the summer of horror on the channel. Uh, of course, oh shoot, uh, shooting the and of course we still have our, our, our Evil Within, which is happening today. Uh, we still have Alan Wake, we still have Outlast. Those are the three primary focus games I'm doing for my playthroughs for Summer of Horror on the channel. Uh, of course, we still have Road to the Show franchise for three different games with Madden, this, and NHL 19, and then Golf Club as well. So lots of sports content, but let me tell you, uh, give you a glimpse into other stuff that is coming to the channel. Oh, golly, and that is a way to start off the episode, ladies and gentlemen, a two-run blast into right field for Nate Stark opening this game up. Now 4-0, the bullpen of the Cubbies loves it. Look at him. The rope of dope and they're doing the, the Macarena. Oh, baby. I love it, but the, 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 the Cubs are getting this thing going. Four runs here in the first inning, and there's no doubt about that one off the bat. But continuing on right before I got sidetracked, uh, we will be seeing some different videos mixed in with all those. So you'll know you get you know you get two uploads a day, Monday through Saturday, at 10 a.m. and 11 a.m. Central Standard Time. Uh, but you're going to be seeing more. Okay, you're going to every so often you'll be seeing some uh, BR games, maybe Apex and Season Two comes, maybe Paladins. I'm playing that. It's like an Overwatch type game for you to play. I'm playing a lot of that, but we're having a blast with it. So various shooter games like that you'll be seeing as a single. Um, but also, I'm excited to say that Madden 20 is coming sooner than I thought, August 2nd. And I will be getting it early because of the EA access, which comes to Xbox Live users, I believe. Um, so I'll be purchasing, get it, I, I think, a whole week early. They give it to people on there, um, at least to get a 10-hour trial. And I'll be using the most of that. I'll be I'll be using that for Face of the Franchise to start that out. I'll be using that for our Dallas Cowboys franchise. Uh, so do expect that Madden content sooner rather than later at the end of July pretty much. So that means instead of doing one Madden upload a week, we're going to be having to do a, a couple a week in order to finish this last season we are with our current Cowboys before the new game comes out. So expect more Madden coming. Uh, you're going to have Madden you know in your staple day. Well, that may be a single. Let's see. Nope, that flies up too high. But you know you already got Madden coming every Wednesday alongside Alan Wake. But do anticipate more Madden. Um, I haven't decided what other days yet. I'll probably just drop it randomly as an afternoon upload. But do expect to see more Madden coming because we've got to finish it. Yeah, we've got to finish this last season before Madden 20 comes and we get going with everything else we're doing. I'm very, very excited about Madden 20 after I watched EA play this year. Um, I, I was very, very happy with what I saw. I loved the, the kind of like the, the, the talents, the, the perks and stuff you get, the abilities superstars get. I'm excited to see what the Cowboys' abilities will be like. I'm really, really eager to see all that. The face of the franchise, even though it's QB only, I'm excited to jump into that mode and give you all a career mode here on the channel as well in Madden, in Madden 20. 
Uh, but there's lots of content, y'all. I'm excited. I'm, and, and, and then after we do finish our Summer of Horror, after we complete all these scary games, we're not done with content. I'm going to continue to bring in new things as well until uh, work picks back up at the end of the summer. So uh, your feedback, though, your contributions as far as your tips and feedback and maybe suggested games, all very crucial here as well. So if you have... Dang it, I was trying to win the bad gun game, and he did! It's a walk-off error! And we win it just like that. We'll take it. The batting clutch works. We forced a awry throw right there. As Rocker comes in to score, and we win this game on a walk-off. Holy crap. And we get player of the game honors to start off this episode as we finish two for five with three RBIs. And how about that for a start today to this episode? Finally getting something going. But yeah, but like I said, no shortage of content here. I know some of... And I'm just going to be honest with you, not, not a lot of people at all are watching my scary game series at all. I mean, the, the most watched one I think I guess is Outlast, but it's not about that. It's not about who's watching what or anything like that. I make the content because I enjoy playing it, and if y'all tune in with me, the more the merrier. Uh, but if not, it's still there for playback in the future for some of you that maybe you decide, hey, I want to watch some Outlast. Maybe I want to watch Alan Wake. That's all there for you guys, so don't, don't hesitate. Go check it out. But do know if you're if you're if you're here for my sports titles, they're not going anywhere, and we're gonna have Madden 20 coming very very soon here on the channel. And lots more Madden, lots more NHL 19, lots more MLB, and the golf club is as well mixed in there. Just a load of content. I'm so so happy about it all. I really am. I've been having a blast with it. Also, uh, we'll be getting a new mic soon. I'm finally upgrading from my Blue Snowball to a Yeti. Um, which I know is like the next, that's like the most overly saturated mic I guess you can have out there in this market for startup YouTubers like me that are small time. But it's going to be a big help, and I think they'll be able to tell the difference. That sucks. Okay. You got me on strike. That ends the inning. That sucks. All right, so 3-1 lead right now. Come back up to the plate. We'll 0 for 1 after that strikeout. Yeah, we got on the mound. And four seam outside, but inside the zone right there. 0 1 count. You know, Maddie, when I first broke into the league, you wouldn't see that high heater first pitch right out of the gate. But I think Golly. that's a difficult pitch to hang off right there. And it was right on the edge of the zone. 0 2 count to start in danger, striking out twice here against his lefty. Now you're seeing guys attack in the and that would have been strike three. We got a piece fouled it off. Just a bit late on it. And it's an 0-2. Repeat once again. Here we go. And swing and a miss on the slider. Two Ks on the day for start. Not a good start to the afternoon. Or the evening, I should say. As we uh, yesterday had a good game. We were two for the four or whatever it was. But now we've got a 5-1 lead. And... 5-2 lead now. 0 for 2, two strikeouts. We've got to turn the tide here. Our game is Thornburg's brought on a lead for the Giants, the righty. And that is hit shallow to the left. And in the glove for the second out there. God damn it. Come on. Got to get something going. It's a 5-5 game now. And as we come up to the plate with two on, two out in the eighth inning, tie game. Got to get the clutch going, right? Got to get some clutch going. Has got is on to relief. And four seam insides fouled off. Let's see another one. Come on, give me a good one. I was very late on that, evidently. There was a change up away. One one count. Thirty-five thousand seven hundred twenty-one on attendance here at Wrigley Field for this excellent matchup. And now this is inside. Brings the count to a 2-1 count for Stark. Looking for his first hit on this game. Here in a clutch situation on a tie game in the eighth. And that is fouled off outside the bottom of the zone right there. 2-2 count. We'll see one more. Here's we are even at two apiece. And swing and a miss on the four seam. Third K on the day. Stark just struggling. Just go figure. We go from having an excellent game to this crap. Just go freaking figure. Dyson on a relief now. One out, no one on here in a tie game in the 11th. Two seem high, fouled off. Are we early? Late. That gum. 
I think it's change up. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Nope, now didn't get me on that one. It was a change up, but we wasn't the change up we were expecting quite right there. So one one count, start 0 for 4 today, looking to get on. One. It opens up a lot of weapons. And there's a go high fastball. That's gonna be a safe play right there. I'm safe. Nobody went nobody really attacked that ball, and that basically worked as a bunt. It's an infield single. We are now on. As the winning run, and the manager wants us to go for the steal here to get a run, winner in scoring position. Uh -oh. Oh. The ball four, we're on. Scoring position now, 0 1 count. The base knock will score us. We're not going to dare try to steal here. We're going to be. We're going. I'm going home. We're going to end this dang game. And we are in safe at home. Back to back days. Stark is involved in the finish. We had the walk off. Or, no, not a walk off. We didn't get a walk off. Never mind. But back to back days, we were involved. We had that big home run last game. Got the win. And then we get this walk off. We came in as a run there from second to home. Uh, McNeil gets player of the game honors as the Cubbies win another. We finished one for five on the day. We got the hit. And that was the one that mattered the most as we got ourselves at a scoring position to we'll come in and score that winning run. As we will go back to the uh, back to the finale, I guess. I think this is the finale of the four game series. And we're gonna look to have a good start here now. And not much going. So we're gonna lead things off batting sixth in the lineup. Three for ten in the series with three RBIs and a home run. We also back in game two of the series. And our goal right now is just to hit a single or better. I'm going up against a sneaker baller cutter, change up slider from Graveman. Big variety on the mound. Here we go. And that is looped over to second. Easy play. One away. On the first pitch swing. That would be better there. Be more patient. That's a tough pitch right there for me to swing up. Pitcher's duel on hand right now. Is nobody able to cross home plate yet? And what pitch was that we saw? We saw the sinker last time up. So. Sinker baller from Graveman. Yeah, Maddie, and we'll sinker like again, and that's an inside part of the plate. Ball low. one. And they keep calling for right it. Here, similar stuff on the mound. Look for them to try and get him to do exactly and That is roped and fair down the line. That's going to be a double. And it will be a stand-up two-out double for Stark. Now in scoring position, hoping to be able to be the first run of this game here. As that was his eighth double of the year. Wilson Contreras now to the plate for the Cubs in a one-two count. Not only does it look like he's going to be a solid contributor, it looks like he may be an impact player at the big league level for years to come. Round ball, first base side, tough play right there. He's going to beat him out at first, so no run does come in the score, so Stark's double is in vain. Uh, now, trailing one nothing, runners at the corners, two outs here in the sixth inning. And we are going to try to drive in the run to tie this game up. Graveman still coming in right now. 77 pitches here. Shoot. Ugly guessing swing there on the cutter. Ooh, crap. That was horrible, 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 horrible. horrible. Sinker high outside. 1-1 one, one count. Come on, man. Give me something good to swing at. Give me something glorious. Okay, okay. And behind on it. Okay. How late was I? Too late. Wow. Sinker's just too much for me to handle right there. One, two count. Stark in trouble. And that is roped and foul on the cutter. Ooh, boy. Almost to give us the lead on this right there. That's ground ball. It's over the glove. Is that going to be an error? Or are we going to get a base knock for that? I think we should get a base hit as hard as that was hit. And I think... They gave us a hit for that, I'm pretty sure, because of the bonus we got with the contact. So that's a good single there for Stark. Gives the Cubbies their first run of the game. And let's go ahead and send to our next appearance because we're not trying to steal any bases out there in that spot. All right, so here we come back up to the plate. Ninth inning to lead things off in a 1-1 game. We're 2-3 for three with a double and a single. Working against Moranta. Moranta? Is that how you say his name? Moranta. And that's up the middle in the gap. That's going to be extra bases. And Stark will get this ninth inning started with a no-out leadoff double. His second of the game, ninth of the year. And the 
Cubs are in business here. We just need a uh, advancement and a sack fly, and this thing is over. What the heck? No, we didn't win it. We got the bases loaded, two out in the tenth. Changeup swung on and missed. Wow. So Thornburg still on here. Stark just needing to get the ball into play and through a gap somewhere. They were driving around to win this game here in the tenth inning. And that is fouled off. Curveball. <sighs> Haven't seen the fastball yet. 0 2 count to start. And probably could try to get him to chase somewhere, high or away. Ooh, good. Excellent, actually. Curveball there. Could have and should have been strike three. Instead, it's ball one. One two count. Made us. He tried to make a play on us right there. Nope. That's not going to do it. And that is the end of the inning. I thought that may bounce off that wall and give us another chance, but it did not. And a new pitcher coming on that we've been relieved for. And we'll see if we can try to get a win here. And we did not. So we lose this last game here. It's a 3-1 loss, unfortunately. But we finished 3 for 5 with two doubles and an RBI. We just couldn't get the game done. As we were able to lead off that ninth inning with that two-out double, got all the way around to third, but we could not come in to score and win that game. And then in that clutch situation, bases loaded two out in the 11th or 10th inning, whatever it was, we were unable to execute there as well. Uh, so kind of bittersweet there, but now we got to play a reeling team right now in the – uh, the Marlins who are just struggling you saw there from their numbers and you better believe it man I want to I want to get those power numbers up even more okay even more and more and more and more and more I want more and more power in our rep repertoire because I want to hit dingers man we got one to begin the episode I'd like to get a couple an episode to be just brilliant all right so here we go managers want to talk us about let's do a Let's do contact and plate power, plate vision just to help us out there. So we're batting fourth in the lineup here now, 21 and 13 on the year. Batting 286 and, two, and 326 of our last 10 games. So we've had one, two, really only one game in our last 10 without a hit, and that came against Miami. Miami, we batted three for, what, 13 against them when we did play them back a little while ago. We'll look to uh, we'll look to change that as they've been struggling. We have Gossman on the mound for the Cubs now, and Stark will look to get things going here, lead things off in the second inning. No hits so far in the game for either side. So going up today now, against Frost on the mound. The He's a lefty, so this sucks. And right down the middle of the plate, we'll watch the strike come in. Oh one. Guys, this Marlins ball club as they begin play here tonight. They come in losers of seven of their last. Cutter that time fouled off. Oh two. Yeah, Maddie, they started this Come on, man. 0-2 right. count to start. There was one common theme. There was great starting pitching. And curveball inside and low misses. 1-2 count now for an 8 start. Let's try to get a good swing here. And that's in the dirt. God damn it. Wow, he threw that high. He's going second. So on the strikeout, Stark actually advances to second base. To lead off the second inning, and uh, we'll take it. Actually, um, I know it doesn't count. I don't, I don't think that counts at all towards your on-base percentage, but it helps the team. So we'll take it. Here's a slide move over, strike three at third, safe at third with a stolen base. So we're going to make the most out of that strikeout. And now Contreras comes to the plate, looking to give the Cubs their early lead, one nothing, possibly two nothing if he can get something just to drive out of the ballpark. Or two count that main he does dribble that. Nope, nope, nope. Popped up, and that is out number two. Nothing going there. And now Castillo to the plate, looking to do the same thing. Maybe driving a run. Come on. 1-0 count. 1-0 count from Castillo. Cleverly gets the nickname Beef. His next pitch coming in. That's up the middle, third base side. He drops it, and that's going to be an RBI. Start comes in to score, and it gives the Cubs a 1 0 lead here in the second inning. Well, there we go. Got the job done, didn't we not? 
got the job done. And now we come back to the play tie game. 0 for 1, we reach on that area. Change up. Swung on and missed there very early on it. 0 1 count to start. Misses away right there. It's a 1 1 count now. Change up once again. Here comes the one two to start. Out and second freaking time in this game. We're going to be safe on a stolen base and on. Wow. I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what to say about that, y'all. That is ridiculous. We Second time in the game we've struck out, but we are on now. And we're going to try again to make the most of our stupid mistakes. Oh, God, he got me. Somebody throw it over someone's head. Ow, he got me. That sucks. That sucks badly. Okay, so we're over with strikeouts today. Trailing now 4-1. to one. Come on, man. Get something going. This guy Frost has just got my freaking number right now. Look at him throwing all everything low. There's a cutter outside. These are huge Come on. innings for a team's morale. The pitcher wants to go out and throw that shutdown inning up and get the boys one back count to start. the bats again with a chance to capitalize and even extend this current lead. Cutter high, inside part, swung on, missed. I'm guessing curveball now. Dad gummit! Why can't I be patient at the freaking plate and not swing at stupid things? Do what I ask. One two count now to start. Way high fastball. Hang off that easily. Come on. Two two count now for Nate. Nope. I didn't go. It's inside. Ball. Woo. Full count now. Two outs. Let's see what we get on this full count pitch. The payoff. Here's the three two. And we hacked at what may have been. Ooh man, that's a tough pitch. See it right there, number six, right? That cut on the outside bottom part of the plate, right on the edge. Probably a good swing at it. Hi. Deep. And gone. It looks like it's a full count. Two run home run for Nate Stark. Second home run of the episode. Oh, that, yeah. Yeah, do the robot back there, fellas. Be happy about it. We are back in this game now, down by a run. As Stark gave that all it could. It was a high fastball. We got it. We hit it. Oppo. And that is a two run bomb now trailing by just a run as we move towards the end of this game in the eighth inning. The start will come to the plate with two on and one away in the eighth. Working against Husky. Righty on the mound. Another ball hit into the gap. That is going to be. Oh, wow. What a catch on the Ivy out there. The runner will tag and go all the way to third and round, but. Gosh, just missed tying this game or maybe giving us the lead. And we fall to the Marlins. That gum it, man. I thought we had that game. I thought I had that extra base hit. But it's a one for four after the two-run home run and should have been more. And the series has ended for the Cubbies here. That gum, man. We had that. I really was feeling it right there, man. So the series ends for the Cubs. Um, Stark, again, we had two home runs in this episode. We're getting ready to go to back, uh, staying home, excuse me. So we're going to finish this episode out with this tough three-game series. Um, I, I, well, at least we're going to start it. We're going to at least start it with this game. Um, we need to get better. Let's get more, let's get more speed. More speed is always going to be helpful. So we're going to jump that speed up now. Yes, sir.
That's going to make infield plays just even harder for people to, to do anything with. We're batting fifth in the lineup now, 77 overall, 384, 284 on the year, uh, with now three home runs and 18 RBIs. And we're going up against a challenging Brave team as we uh, go up against Max Freed, or Fried, or Freed, whatever. He's a lefty. And we struggle against lefties, so we got our work cut out for us here in this game. But hopefully we can make the most of it. Chase Whitley on the mound. He's 4-0 for the Cubs so far today, or this year. And we're going to finish out this home stretch and try to get a big win here. And so we will come up in a scoreless game in the second to lead things off. Get a single or better will be the goal. A beautiful day here from Wrigley. And here comes Freed. And this is low, 1-0 okay. count. Well, boys, these Braves, as they take the field here tonight, they come in here hoping to make it two in a row as they broke a three-game It's low as well, 2-0. Hey, I guess guys are realizing the start can actually hit the ball a little bit better now, so we're staying away a little bit. I don't know. Ah, we're late on the four scene. I didn't know the speed at which we were going to see that. That's at 93. We're late on it. Very late, actually. God damn it. Change up. Ooh, good pitch right there. Got it swinging over the top. 2-2 two -two count. After being ahead 2-0, it's now even. And that's a ground ball shortstop. Or second base, excuse me. A high throw, but the Freeman's got it. He got us. Two away. Now we're getting whipped. Holy crap. 4 nothing. Wow. Bad inning there. He's now 4 nothing game in the fourth inning. We're looking for our second hit of the game. Two outs now. And foul off the force on the way. 0-1 count to Nate. That's another high fastball. We're going to give a watch to this, though. 92 on the outside part. Upside. Up, up, up and out on the plate right there. 1-1 count for Nate Stark. And that's up the middle. Gets through by the umpire's leg. That's a two-out single for Nate Stark here in the fourth inning. And maybe the start to a, a little bit of a rally here to away the fourth. We can, we can hope. Now Castillo comes to the plate one two count. We're going to try to move on the base pass here. That's in the lose in this case. Here we go. There's a grind. It's over the third baseman's head. We're going to third. We'll have runners at the corners now. It's two away. And the aggressiveness pays off there for Stark and the Cubs. I'll bring up our center fielder, Ian Happ, now with a chance to get the Cubs on the board. 2-2 two -two count. And he's freaking strikes out. Happ, come on, man. Nothing going for the Cubbies, and now we're trailing 5-1. Our leadoff man gets on for the Cubs here in the sixth. And start to the plate, looks to... Try to do something here against Hardy, the left in the mound coming in, second pitch of the game. The four seam high, fouled off late. An 89 mile per hour fastball. Cutter away and low, gave a terrible swing to it. Oh crap, 0 2 count for Nate. More than likely, he's going to beat it into the ground. Nope. Check the swing I didn't go. 1-2. What was that? Change up on the outside part of the plate. Wow, good pitch. That's a good pitch right there. We're lucky we didn't get rung up on that. Early on that one. That was a cutter. But we'll do it again. 1-2 again. Cutter on the... Ooh. This guy's doing some good stuff right now. Look at all those placements. He's just been right around the zone. That one's easy to hang on for. 2-2 two, two count. I'm waiting for that high fastball. I'm waiting for it again. I've only seen one. We're early on that. Fouled off. Which was that another cutter? Yep. Another cutter. This will be the eighth pitch of the at-bat. And and shoot. Just wear him down. The speed got me. I thought it was a cutter coming. It was a change. He got us ahead of it. Wing and miss. 5 1 game in the eighth. We come back to the plate. No one on two away. We just got to get on. 
We just got to get on base. Got a left, a righty on the mound finally for us. Oh. Hit opposite field on a rope to the left fielder. That gummit. And that's going to be it for us, man. We get a 5-1 shellacking at the hands of the Braves here at home. Stark has a single, and that's it in the loss. Just not a lot of offense coming the Cubs' way right there. And it hurt us. We drop a big one there to the Braves. And we'll come back to the next game of the series and try to right the wrongs that was the offensive ways. Now 22-15. and 15. A little easy on the mound for the Cubs to try to right this ship. And wow. Did you see all those walks? We are down freaking six. Zero. Can't even with you, little reason. Can't. That's in the dirt now. It's 94 outside. 1 0 counts. Come on, Stark. Get something going. Get something going. Get this team to get out of the freaking ways. Foul off that page. 1 1 count. That was a terrible inning we just had. Terrible inning. Yeah, guys, after the first four games on this, road, this is low one two, two one now. Two, kind of par for the course, but they find so two one coming to start. Today, kind of turn the tide and get it working in a positive direction. Foul off that pitch away. Two two. We've seen all fastballs so far. Miss that bat. And here's another one inside. Ah, we're early on it. Gum it. Off-speed pitch. Second baseman's got it. Makes the play to first. Freeman, one away. And the Cubs just, we are struggling. Um, we have one hit so far. There's our second hit to double with two outs here in the fourth. So you're telling me they scored six runs on three hits. That's how many walks they had. They're able to drive in runs that way. Holy crap. All right. Inside, ball one. Come on. The Great hitters count now for Stark. We'll see what we get. That's a 2 0 count, and both of those pitches were really close. And there's right, the fastball. Two and one the count. And that's a 2 1. Runner in scoring position. Cubs needing some runs to get going for me. Swing and a miss on the four seam. I don't blame the batter for pulling the trigger right there. Those fastballs Freaking light up stupid. your eyes, and you can occasionally do damage with them. But he wasn't able to catch up with that. One. This is away with the slider, full count. This will be the sixth pitch of the at bat now. Some pitchers fall into the trap of giving in on three and two because they don't want to walk the guy. But with the base open, it's not the end of the world if you do. God dang it! How are we late? Leave it there, as this is strike three, and that. We deserve to lose. We're getting our butts kicked. Seventh inning, come back now. We've got Hardy on in relief to lefty. I suck. Kidding me? Down by a bundle. It's time to get some base runners and freaking terrible. To get them back into this one. O2 count. Might as well just give me the strike. I already feel it. I already feel it in my freaking bones. Wind up and the 0-2 pitch. The next the cutter trailing away right outside. there. He works fast. Tough pitch There's to the lay off there, low. but he did, and it's even up at two and two. Two two count now after being behind 0-2. Now we're eating. Now we're full count. What a great at bat to start this inning off. Hey, this could be a productive inning. Ground ball, second base side. Another ground out for Stark. Not a good game, man. Not at all. 6 2 deficit, solo home run. It's over. So it's 7 3 game here in the ninth inning. We're here just to try to get something going. 0 for 3 on the day. Baez just hit a solo home run. And we're going to hit that into the gap. He's got it. He's out there too. So it's going to be an O for to finish this episode. Contreras gets a solo home run. 7-4 loss at the hands of the Braves. And uh, 
That sucks, man. But that's where we're going to end today's episode, y'all. I thank y'all so much for tuning back in. We got a two home run day. Um, overall, the episode wasn't terrible. We had good moments. We've had, like you just saw with that finale, uh, bad moments as well. But uh, the team's got some offensive struggles going on right now. We've uh, we've kind of fallen away from what made us good. We're going to go ahead and simulate through that last game, see how we did. Uh, let's see. Let's go do this. Training. Let's get the power up. But uh, that's where we're going to end it, y'all. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a thumbs up, comment down below, hit that notification bell, subscribe button so you never miss out on any videos, and help us reach towards four or sorry, 2,000 subscribers. We're not quite there yet for 4,000, but 2,000. We've already passed 1,400 subs, y'all. Thank you all so much for being a part of this growing community and making these videos a part of your day. Again, thank you all so much. Y'all have an outstanding day, and I'll see you all back here in the next video. Y'all take it easy. <laughs>